I'm going to start with my steering column. I'm making sure that I have uh, no more than an inch of play on my steering column. It is metal, so it's not bent, cracked, or damaged. The boot's in good condition, and so are the U-joints. My steering box is properly secured to the frame of my vehicle. It is not damaged or leaking. My pitman arm, drag link, steering arm, and tie rod are metal, so they're not bent, cracked, or damaged, and they're secured to each other with their castellated net and cotter pin. Uh, from there, I'm gonna move on to my suspension. I have both spring hangers. They're secured to the frame of my vehicle in good condition. My leaf springs, I have no more than a quarter of them broken or missing. My keepers are in place and my shackles in good condition. It's metal, not bent, cracked or damaged. Uh, and everything's properly secured to the axle of my truck with its proper hardware. Uh, also have a shock absorber. It's secured on both ends, not damaged or leaking. From there, I move on to my brake system. My airline is secured on both ends, not cut or leaking. My brake chamber is secured with its clamp and in good condition. My slack adjuster isn't missing any parts and it's also secured to my vehicle. If I pull on my push rod, I can have an inch of play or if somebody's helping me, I can have two inches. From there, I move on to my, uh, uh, to my brake pads. There's no oil or grease on them, which would cause brake failure. No black powder, uh, meaning I have excessive wear, or white powder, meaning uh, somebody put out a fire. If I look at my brake pads itself, I have I should have more than a quarter inch of life left on my brake pads, and that puts me on my rims, inside, outside, no damage to my rims, no illegal welds, no shiny threads on my lug nuts telling me that they're loose, or rust trail indicating that they're damaged. I'm also not missing any of my lug nuts. My hub seal is secured with its proper hardware and it is not damaged or leaking. My valve stem is also in good condition, not damaged or leaking, and the cap is on. That puts me onto my tire. Both sides, both sidewalls, no cuts, no bulges. The tire is wearing evenly. Uh, the tire tread up here should be 430 seconds and these cannot be recapped. Uh, the tire pressure is a minimum of 100 PSI or what's indicated on the tire puts me on my mud flap. It is secure to my vehicle, not rubbing against my tire or dragging on the ground. 